Oh, this is proper cricket. What a goodie. Oh, and he just gets down on that in time and gets off the mark. Well played. A couple of outswingers and then the one sliding back in through bat and pad. Far too good for Tim Bresnan, and he knows it. They're all congregating in the middle. Nah, it's off his leg. Quieting it down. For the second time in one day cricket, it's a Jaffer ball swinging back into the left handed Stuart Broad. Castled him. Middle stump out the ground. Good debate amongst uh, the senior men of the Pakistan side, mainly Afridi and Muhammad Yusuf, about who should bowl this over. And it is Umar Gul's last. They've gone for Gul because they can win the game here. He's on his way back. Well, just a little flick is uh, you know, not a great ball. And that could be straight down the throat of deep square leg. Well, Graham Swan knows. So do Pakistan. It's their night, I think, now. An incredible spell of bowling. Six for 42, his best figures. Quite incredible stuff here. I'm sure he was trying to aim probably more in front of square and over mid-wicket. He's got it too fine. Is that the little twist in the game? Well, this is incredible bowling. He's taken the ball across Marco Yardi and then he just brings this one back, swinging back into the left-hander. Ah, that's dead, that's pitched in line, he's going on to hit the stumps. Good decision from Richard Illingworth. Real game on now, Umar Gul's on fire. Ah! Caught behind! Certainly it was an edge and he probably should have caught it. Oh, that's a good start, too. It's just drawn into playing at that. Oh, dropped, is it? Oh, maybe. Buddy, thick outside edge. That was diving across first slip. Yep, big edge. Now nah, you've got to catch them. Two hands to the ball. You have to take those opportunities. That's good bowling again from Gully really represents the big threat for the immediate strike and if Pakistan continue to take wickets who knows it's uh, been a pitch that's offered a little bit more sideways movement than we might have predicted but England now if he can uh, winkle out a couple of others he's still got seven overs to bowl he's making the ball zip around off this surface oh that could be close so that's out LBW now we really do have a game Brilliant bowling by Omar Gul, he's really turned this situation around. The perfect Yorker at 90 mph, that'll do for most people. That's a beauty. Mm. That's sensational bowling. But oh dear, well that's definitely out. <laughs> that wasn't... Uh... Exactly what the doctor ordered, a bit uh, fraught, that shot from Bresnan. Oh dear, well that's definitely out. <laughs> well that's out. And probably dragged on, great celebrations from Mumar Gul. Well game on. Let's watch the Pakistani celebrations, they know that Andrew Strauss is the key wicket. Playing so well, look at that. Pakistan have a real chance now, pressure on the guys coming in. Excellent running. <laughs> Real scramble, Luke's got himself back on the strike. And all of a sudden, is it the, the real interesting switch is this, the crowd, because suddenly their English voices are cheering every run in the way that Pakistan voices were cheering every wicket. Drifting onto the pads and gets the treatment. You hardly see that beautiful piece of timing one more time. Ah, oh, put down! Here's an opportunity gone begging. Big 
make big shot. Keepers out. This is short, poor delivery. That should be another boundary, back-to-back -back boundaries for Tajul Islam. Fuller, and nicely played. Just a touch Fuller on that occasion, and it put that uh, nicely for of another bound. Westwell ball just uh, holding it back a little bit, finds in outside edge, get past the fielder, and goes to the boundary. Bold in, Max Yorker. Tremendous delivery. Nicely done, well. Turned away really nicely, timed it superbly and it's gone all the way. Yes, it was a, a lazy shot really. As you say, weight on the back foot, the length absolutely perfect. And just a little bit of in movement, the back slightly crooked as it came down. So everything wrong with the shot and everything right with the delivery. Away. Little favoured dab into the leg side should be a comfortable three for Timim. Coming up front bowling. And there's an outside edge. Straight away. The debutant has to go. Second ball. The characteristic. Big shot, but maybe just the end. Short pulled away. That's for it has set up nicely the bounce uh, short one. Oh, don't move a muscle. Nazmo. Oh, on the charge through cover. Oh, handsome. Wonderful connection. John playing away from his body. No foot movement, got the thin outside edge, an easy take. Oh, that's uh, a shade lucky. He's going to get himself uh, a boundary. Just felt the bowler will feel. Another sweep. This is great stuff from uh, Najmul Hussain. He was on top of that. Uh, Bounce and uh, I think in the end negotiated that very nicely using the pace of the ball, just angling the bat enough to take it to the boundary. Shot. Hit hard, beautifully struck, showing his class. That's gone through and get one uh, at that forward short leg. That's nicely played, finds the gap, finds the boundary. Go to Cracker! Another sucker punch! Width on offer. And there's the salute. Scenario for them where they've promised to deliver and not really been able to. Oh, inside edge, narrow escape for the newcomer. Well, how about that? Once you attain the test level, you're expected to play well, get runs like this, it's a bit of a teaser, the ball wins the race to the boundary. Another cut shot, another four. Nicely done, what a delectable shot that is. Eased into it, just a sheer timing and placement, takes it to the boundary. Getting the ball to bend both ways, and the batsman had no idea which way it's going. And only uh, smile ruefully and hope you miss those. Well, he's got ten balls left. This is Pakistan's chance. Now, and that's a milestone they'll be pretty happy to achieve. Well, hit that pretty hard and it's straight into the hands and out of it. Oh, that, that must have stung. Yeah, well, he's got that bandaged, <coughs> excuse me, left hand. Yeah, this is uh, struck rather firmly. 
so annoying. There's a bit of blood here, is there? It's happening here. Has he got it right on the, on the end? No, oh, that's uh, over the top. It really didn't get a hold of it. Not the way he wanted to, but... It's just... Oh, he's just uh, lost it after a long, long while. They are a little surprised because he showed a lot of resilience, this, did uh, Tajul Islam, but lost his cool, little rush of blood, and he has to go. Look at these celebrations. They won the Test match here, and now they win the ODI.